not forget to subscribe to my channel and press the bell icon for daily updates. Hello friends, welcome to Express Current Affairs. Let us see the important topics covered from today's Hindu newspaper along with the important questions that might appear in coming exams. If you did not yet subscribe to my channel, please do it now so that you do not miss every day's important current affairs. I have provided you the yesterday's video's PDF link in today's description box. So people who do not have proper Wi-Fi, no need to worry from now onwards. You can download the PDF link and read it whenever you want in offline mode. Let's start. First question, National Constitutional Day celebrated every year on November 22nd, November 24th, November 26th or November 28th? The answer is C, November 26th, very important day. The Government of India declared 26th of November as Constitution Day. Now we celebrate this Constitution Day from the year 2015 onwards. The year of 2015 is the 125th birth anniversary of Ambedkar. We all know Ambedkar was the chairman of the drafting committee of the Constituent Assembly and he played a vital role in drafting our constitution. Now why only on 26th of November we celebrate as Constitution Day? Now this is a preamble of our constitution. Read the last four lines mentioned in the preamble. In a constituent assembly this 26th day of November 1949, do hereby adopt, enact and give to ourselves this constitution. Now this means our constitution has been adopted and enacted on 26th of November 1949. Now you need to remember the day, month and year very important from exam point of view. Many times they ask this question. Many people get confused the answer as 26th of January 1950 but that is not the answer. The answer is 26th of November 1949. Now you need to know each and every word mentioned in the preamble of our constitution very important. So learn word for word. Now previously they asked who are the makers of the constitution. Is it the government of India? Is it the members of the constituent assembly? Is it the Ambedkar of chairman of the drafting, constitu drafting committee? Or is it the people of India? Read the first line of the preamble. We the people of India have been solemnly resolved to constitute India. This means the makers of the constitution are the people. So don't get confused and read the third sentence sovereign socialist secular democratic and republic you need to buy heart all these words in the series as it is mentioned in the preamble don't jumble words read as it is very important asked many times in exam now the word sovereign socialist secular and republic obtained from latin and democratic is a word obtained from greek so many questions can be framed from preamble of India. So read thoroughly, very important. Prophet Muhammad birthday is celebrated by which of the following names? Miladun Nabi, Eid al Adha, Eid al Fitr, or Muharram. The answer is A. Miladun Nabi. Now yesterday Prophet Muhammad's birthday has been observed and members of the Muslim community took part in a rally in connection with Miladun Nabi. Now this question has been asked previously in Public Service Commission. You need to know each and every festival celebrated in India in detail. Muslims constitute almost 14% of the population in India. From exam point of view, learn all the important minority religious community festivals of Muslims, Sikhs, Christians, Buddhists, Parsis and Jains. Now let us see the remaining events. Eid al Adha, now this is a festival of sacrifice. It honors the willingness of Ibrahim or Abraham to sacrifice his son as an act of obedience to God's command. Eid al Fitr, it marks the end of Ramadan fasting. 
The day is celebrated as the conclusion day of fasting. Now Moharram, Hussein ibn Ali, the grandson of Muhammad, was martyred in battle of Karbala. So on this day, Muslims mourn for Hussein ibn Ali and refrain from all joyous events. So these are the important events followed by Muslim community. So please do remember from exam point of view, very important. The sentinel tribes are seen in which part of India? Andaman Islands, Lakshwadweep Islands, Western Ghats or Eastern Ghats? The answer is A. Andaman Islands. Very important. You need to remember all the tribes of India and their locations. Now recently this is in news because John Allen Chow, the American nationalist has been allegedly killed by the Santorinese tribes. Now these tribes are located in North Sentinel Island of Andaman. They are designated as scheduled tribes by government of India. The Santorinese are hunter-gatherers. They use bow and arrows to hunt terrestrial wildlife and they refuse any interaction with the outside world. Which of the following is a constitutional body? Central Bureau of Investigation, Central Information Commission, Election Commission or Planning Commission? The answer is C. Election Commission. No one must know what are the constitutional bodies, statutory bodies, advisory bodies, extra constitutional bodies and non-constitutional bodies. Very important from polity, one expected question. And this question has been asked recently, so don't miss this area. Now this is an article which is mentioned in editorial of today's Hindu newspaper. Supreme Court considers PIL, Public Interest Litigation, strengthening the Election Commission of India. Now in general at present, the Chief Election Commissioners and the Election Commissioners of the state is appointed by the government of the day without any defined criteria that means no proper qualifications are prescribed to appoint these officials and no proper rules are fo followed on what basis one is appointed as CECs and ECs. There are many talented and intelligent people to be recruited but we need the ethical and capable people to head the crucial institutions like Election Commission. Now if you are preparing for CGL, CHSL, Railways and Banking, remember the article, Article 324 talks about Election Commission of India. The appointment of the Chief Election Commissioner is done by the President. The term of CEC is 6 years or 65 years of age, whichever is earlier. But if you are preparing for UPSC or State Public Service Commissions, then you need to know the entire election system in India. Who has been elected recently as Interpol President 2018? Kim Jong-yang of South Korea, Alexander of Russia, Michael of USA or Meng Hongwei of China? The answer is A. Kim Jong-yang of South Korea. Now, South Korean candidate chosen as Interpol chief. The International Criminal Police Organization is commonly known as Interpol. Remember the headquarters, very important, Lyon of France. The motto of Interpol is connecting police for a safer world. It focuses primarily on public safety and battling the crimes against humanity, child pornography, cybercrime, drug trafficking, environmental crime, genocide, human trafficking, etc. Which company has stopped the Grohe Hurun India Real Estate Rich List 2018? DLF, Loda Group, Embassy Group or My Home Group? The answer is B. Loda Group. Loda Group had topped the India Real Estate Rich List the founder of Loda Group is Mangal Prabhat Loda, tops with almost 27,150 crore. Jitendra Virvani of Embassy Group tops, stood at second place in 23,160 crore. 
Rajiv Singh, son of DLF founder, stood at third place with 17,690 crore. Now he is the Mangal Prabhat Loda, founder of Loda Group. He is the Indian politician belonging to the Bharatiya Janata Party and he hails from Maharashtra. India plays with which country in the semi-finals of ICC Women's T20 World Championship 2018? England, New Zealand, Australia or West Indies? The answer is A. England. Now if you look at the recent examination pattern, they are even asking the semi-finals teams. So please do remember because this is a world championship, you need to remember the list of teams reach the semi-finals. Now, India looks for a revenge in this match against England. In 2017, England had won the ICC Women's World Cup Championship. England won by 9 runs in the finale, defeating India. Now, coming to this T20 World Championship 2018, India had never won the T20 Women's World Cup so far. But it had reached 3 times in the semi-finals. So, let's hope that it will win the cup this time and Australia has won majority of times that is three times and England had won one time. So this is it for today. Stars can't shine without darkness. Remember many successful people reached their goal because they have overcome all their difficulties and believed that they can do it even in their bad times. So always keep yourself motivated. If you like my videos, please do subscribe and mention your views in the comment section. Have a nice day. Bye-bye. Thank you all for watching. Please do not forget to like, share and subscribe.